Hey YouTubers, I uh, wanted to show you a very simple way of removing my captain's chair in my 2005 Fleetwood Southwind uh, W22. Uh, I checked all over the internet looking for my particular seat or captain's chair. Um, mine is a flex steel and it, they're both power. The, passenger's power, the driver's power, and I could not find anything showing one that looked like this. Uh, I'm removing it so I can have it reupholstered, the bottom, but at any rate, uh, I'll, I'll show you, obviously I have it out already, but I'll show you how simple it was. I've seen a few videos where different style seats, I guess, come out a different way, but if you have one that's like this, that has the base plate like I'm showing you. Oh, and by the way, that's going to be my seat for a few days in this thing if I have to move it. Uh, and I'm recarpeting. But at any rate, uh, there's the power plug. Very simple. It unsnaps from the, I guess it's the female end or if this is the male. I think this is the female end. Uh, just squeeze and pull apart. Um, the captain's chair itself is held on only by four bolts. So you don't need to take this whole base plate out if you're looking at removing the chair itself, uh, replacing the chair, you know, assuming it doesn't come with the, the uh, base plate. Um, it's very simple. I'll, I'll show you here. There are studs on the bottom of the chair. I'll show you in a minute. They line up with these four bolts, bolt holes, there and back here there and that guy now these are going to be a little challenge back here to 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 get the bolt these two bolts back on but it's doable uh front ones will be a piece of cake so i'm going to send out the seat to get reupholstered reinstall it with four bolts a plug and that's it let me go around and i'll show you the uh the chair itself here's the beast I just got this about a month ago, and I'm doing some restoration on it. Not that you really care, but anyway. There's the chair uh, removed. And as you can see there, there is the stud. There's one of the studs coming out. That fits into the front holes, obviously. What I also found was, you see the cable there. I'm presuming that's going to uh, connect to the bottom of the pedestal. There's a, a little female end of it, so I can... I can swivel it um, and I'm guessing that's what that's for it's never been hooked up there's the other one the other end of the power plug and in the back it's resting on the other two studs should be a very simple process I just wanted to show you how easy it is if you're thinking of taking out your seat four bolts a plug you don't have to remove the seat belts or at least in mine you don't uh, and this is again this is the flex steel uh, captain's chairs and they're basically the driver's side is the full power the other one's semi-power but at any rate hope this helps somebody